creating a sh crafting a shield. Okay. Uh, five hearts. So what do you say? It's a shield because you only get five hearts per adventure part. Oh. Well, that's basically a fill in here too. Makes for Oh, clever. Nice call to the beginning of the dungeon. Or the beginning of the game. Well. I really don't know how to be cr tactful about this, so I'm just going to do it this way. So, I'll s see you guys on the other side when I have chosen my... Well, everything. And the award for biggest car crash of a dungeon goes to... My god, I uh... Well, you know... I could do something here, hold on. No, we're not done yet. I just had an idea, because I just used this entrance a bit ago. Where is the one with the single left exit? Yes. And then transform this into just... A treasure room. Nah, not that one. Sure, that one. There you go. Biggest car crash of a dungeon. Ay, ay, ay. So the fun thing is, I think I unintentionally made this with way too way more way many more keys than is actually necessary to complete it. But I'm still gonna excuse me, do it anyway. Alright. The uh stipulation I put on it. So I can go up into this room. But I think I do a dang thing in here, just because there's nothing in here at all. So then I think it forces me to do this boss fight here. Also, I think I have two Henoxes as bosses in this dungeon. Oh well. Hi. Hi. Whoop! Hi, 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 no, that's not cool. Okay. Cute. 
No laughing. This is no laughing matter, young man. I thought the blue Hinox was the toughest Hinox. I didn't I didn't think that one was gonna be. I didn't think that was gonna be as resilient as it was. But yeah, I have uh, 12 locked doors. Unintentionally, I have 12 locked doors and 16 chests. Oh, that worked. Well, because I trust how I built this dungeon, I'm gonna do something dumb. Ready for dumb move number uno? Touch. I'm gonna open it for the sake of opening it. That's it. Now, I'm pretty sure most people who look at a dungeon or are better at design dungeons than I am will probably look at this and go, Oh god, that is horrendous. What did you do? There. And with this four-way room... Right, that's how I designed it. I wonder if I can actually get those rupees in the lava. Huh. Neat. And I do think I do think it is this is structured in such a way where I do have to collect every single treasure. So um, I know last time I said I know the last dungeon I said I had I had a proposition for you guys, but I have totally forgotten what that proposition was. Probably something about dungeon making in some regard. I guess I would almost say like you know what's your guys's dungeons and whatnot. But I don't think there's really a good way to share dungeons and play those with each other. Unless... I... Unless... I'm gonna say we, even though I'm gonna tell you not to do this. Unless you go out and buy the amiibo in question. Unless you go out and buy a Legend of Zelda amiibo specifically to put your dungeon on and then send me, and then send me that amiibo in the mail. Which, again, don't. But I feel like that'd be like the only way to share a dungeon nowadays with somebody, it's, it, at least in this current format. Maybe as time goes on, and there, and you know, this could be what everybody's speculating that Nintendo is testing the waters with with the dungeon with the dungeon creator and possibly making a Zelda maker. Your tail. Show me your tail once again. I want to shot you. Hey. Who said you could do that? Who said you could do that? I want answers. I want their name, their address, their phone number, their social security number, their social social security number. And two and two separate IDs indicating that they are allowed to be the president of New Brunswick. That is a that is just a string of words that came as as the cool kids say, a, a diary of the mouth. It just kinda splurted out. It was fun! Man, did that sentence make no sense to a single person involved. Hey, look, a fairy. I keep me, I keep forgetting. I have only five hearts to go through. Which makes me worry and wonder. If I die in here, if I die in here, do I have to make the dungeon all over again, or does it save it? Regardless, I'm going to keep being reckless. Oh, well. I don't need to fight the Virum again. I just need my handy dandy bombs and a boomerang to make me feel better about myself. I really do just I really do just be sucking my thumb using that using this boomerang for everything now that I have legally purchased it. Okay, whatever. Right, club is after spade. There. I feel better about myself already. Um. Sorry, I'm like looking at something else in my second monitor, so I'm totally distracted right now. I'll handle that between episodes. Right, I should jump first. Listen, Slime Man, you're gonna need to stop moving. Were you actually given a proper name, by the way? I just I just thought of that. Oh boy. I have put many a foe in this place, haven't I? No. The feather stays on. 
I, I like, I have realized that, uh, oh well. I have, don't worry, I am, I am privy to what I've done this entire playthrough where, unless it is pivotally necessary for me to, unless it was pivotally necessary for me to take the feather off for whatever reason, the feather never, never came off of my, of my, uh, item bar. So, the rock's feather has been equipped for about 90% of this, of this, uh, project. Now, can I have a key, please? Actually, this dungeon is kind of devilish. Thinking back on it. Because, you know, I, I it is devilish, because, like, unless you know how to beat every single room in this place, you're not clearing out every single room in this place. Or you're not clearing out the dungeon. And I'm gonna need powder in the next room. So I unintentionally made a really smart puzzle. Can I get two with once? Yeah, I can. Bop. Beep. <laughs> I do. I do like this. I, I do like. I do, I'm getting more into this. Like free flow creativity is not exactly my forte. By the way, that's the that's the nightmare key which we got to come back for later. Uh, free flow creativity has is not really my thing, but when I'm like giving a divining rod of sorts to work with, hey, who said you could do this? I think I'm floating, by the by. Um, like when I'm given constraint-based creativity, like hey, do this thing, do this dungeon, or do this thing with this specific pattern laid out, I can usually come up with something. But if I'm just, if it's just like, hey, here's an easel, go. Ah, uh, why? Also, I literally, ha I literally put this room where it is because I, I literally had to make a room with a lock here, and I couldn't find anything else that was like suitable. To be on, to be, one hundred percent honest with you, you know, as the cool kids say, keeping it a hundred. I really do feel like I'm, I'm trying to be the cool uncle half the time. I say stuff. Excuse me, that's my ball. My ball. Thank God you're not like the Oracle games where you where you will teleport the ball to you if I'm holding it for too long. That is something that will happen, and I know I bring up the Oracle games a lot in this project. To answer the question, yes, I would like to play the Oracle games. When am I going to do it? I still don't know. It will happen at some point. Keep, keep your pants on. Keep your pants on. I'll get to it eventually, don't worry. I just don't know when. Considering right now my mental plans, I got a lot of... I only have a few games where I can... Right, I only have a few games planned right now where I can kind of do things willy-nilly. Yep, ow. Uh, but yeah, I only have a few games planned at the moment where, like, I can do a blind project. Or I can do, like, my normal, I know what I'm doing, I'm guiding. Um. I lost my train of thought. In the middle of that chest opening. Wow. Um, in my normal, in my normal shtick of guiding everybody through a dungeon, like I have done for the past ten years now, like I'm, I am, I am, unfortunately, running low on those games. Yeah, I'm running a little dry on on those specific games that I can be like, oh hey, here's how you do this thing. Ha 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 ha. Uh, the link that wasn't the wall in question, but okay. You got it, champ. Uh, sorry. I had a yawn there. I must not be all in my proper headspace to, to record this today or something. But I want to get it done so I can work on other things. And the nightmare key, I presume. Hey. Hey. Did mom say you could do this? Well, mom lied.
All right, now just head back to the Nightmare's Lair, and hopefully the game won't crash on me again. Again, doing that cool kid, saying the cool kid phrases, keeping it a hundred with you. I have never had my Switch crash on me while I've been while I've been record while I've been playing a game, much less recording it. Oh, well, there we go. I feel like I, I like using that room in that way where I just block off where I do just fly out block off the uh, way back to the to the nightmares layer with the door where you have to clear the tiles I don't know if that's just happenstance that it keeps happening that way or what uh, that was totally an accident I legit did not mean to do that anyway I'm glad my hearts respawned Okay, so one more room up. And I will say, like, if you, if you, like, viewer at home, if you were to play this, I can already, I can understand that this is not a good, this is not a good dungeon. This, this entire dungeon, not a good dungeon to actually play through. I literally just have it here. I forgot this is who I stuck at the end. Dang it. And one of these times I'm going to get it. I'm going to get maximum value out of this thing too. Could we... I'm eventually going to get it. Hold on. Come here. Ugh. Got him. Oh, I'm at one heart. And he's at no hearts. That would be embarrassing to go through all this and then just die right the last second. Well. I have made a shield. Alright, what do I get? Still get 300 rupees. So this is all optional stuff through and through. But I'm still enjoying it. But I'm going to have to call it on this one for now. So next time on Legend of Zelda... Link's Awakening, the remake. We'll come back we'll do more of Dompe's challenges. I'll see you folks next time. Take care.